All right, guys. Welcome to today's part. It's called "What If Smash Bros. Had Akuma." Akuma, you will feel my wrath. Honestly, you would feel his wrath. Although, I wonder if, if they would have made Akuma easier than the Echo Fire or just the main character in general. We are the battle. Honestly, I think Akuma would have been his own character because one, he's Akuma. Two. Iconic is Ryu, so yeah. I wouldn't say okay, so, <laughs> about that iconic as Ryu. I wouldn't say as iconic, but I, I would say he's popular. This is the path so, of my destiny. Yeah. Round one. But, yeah, Fight. Like, like his reset would be the same as Ryu, and he would have a different one. Like when he does the command input. Or like when he goes down in the air, basically. See, when he goes down in the air, you can go like that or something. But he can have a totally different move set than the Kikus. Like honestly, like, if Snatchers did have a team up in the game, that would be perfect. I would love to see that. You like my vision. I feel like Akuma Round would have been a better choice than Ken. Although Ken did deserve, you know, <laughs> a spot to be used as a fighter of the game. One, they're, they're both original characters. Like, Akuma can have two final smash because one could be like that, or one could be like that. They don't want to be a whole game doing like But there isn't going to be a thing up close. I wonder what he did from that for his, uh, you know, Tazuma gets pretty good. Akuma wins! Yeah, Akuma's Akuma. And he deserves to be in Smash Bros. So yeah, um, if they wanted to go with Bakuma's design for Smash Bros. Yes. No. I am the one true Hado. No, you're not. Back to it. Round one. So Fight. Akuma's design would be his Street Fighter 2 design, of course. That's like his most iconic design. Also, Akuma in Smash Bros. would be amazing. But yes, they they could give the Kuma like a totally different moveset to you, like I said. <laughs> so the Kuma could have this stage be here or some other stage. But yeah, I mean Akuma. I mean, he's in Tekken, he's in this game, he's in Marvel's Tekken 3. Akuma really deserves to be in this game, in this game. Not in this one, but... I mean, yeah, he deserves to be in Street Fighter, but that's the game. He deserves to be in Smash Bros. I mean, he's like the arch nemesis, basically. For Gaio, his arch nemesis is in Smash Bros. For Gaio's arch nemesis is in Bison. Wait, 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 how do I do it again? Oh, it's been a while. That, 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 okay. This one is tight. Okay, never mind. But at least we know what the trigger move is. Now you see, this is real power. No, that's what, no, you're not, you, you're never going to smash those Kage, no, no. Fight. Akuma would probably be the next trick for, you know. I mean, okay, to me, it's between Chun Li and Kuma to be the next character. Then Smash Bros. as a issue for the rush. Let him. 
Akuma really has, you know, he deserves Akuma to be it. I, I, honestly, I really, really thought Akuma was going to get added in this final ultimate, but he wasn't, but he wasn't, uh, you know, added to Ken. Although, hmm, one of which characters, I'm sure that it would make it in the game. It would be interesting to see, you know, Chun-Li, Guile, maybe. I, honestly, could Guile be next for the chat, for the... She better rep, like, better she better rep, I don't even really know, but, yeah, let's, um, well, thanks for watching the video, and, uh, stay tuned for the next one, um, I'm gonna figure out who I'm gonna talk about next.